Hello friends, Future Topher here. So when I was recording this particular recording session, I had the wrong microphone turned on, or I didn't have the right microphone turned on, I guess. So the audio in this is still audible. Like you can still hear me, everything's fine. It's just, it sounds a little weird, like I'm in a tunnel a little bit, and you can hear just a lot of ambient noise, which you wouldn't hear with my normal microphone. So. Apologies for that, um, but yeah. Bye. Hello, hello, and welcome back to the channel. As most of you know, I'm Topher. And for those of you who don't know and just randomly decided to click on my video, welcome to the channel. I'm Topher. Thank you for stopping by. So we're here to do a reaction, and we are diving into a new series on the channel. Um, if you saw my channel update video for February 2022, you would have seen the list of BL series that I had planned to dive into this month. And one of them was one that I was looking forward to because I reacted to the trailer a couple, like a month, two months ago, and I really enjoyed it, and you guys have been begging, begging me to dive into the Max Toll universe for the longest. So we are finally doing it. We are diving into Manor of Death, which I am very, very excited about just because, I mean, it looks just different, different from any other BL series that I've watched thus far, and I like, I like diving into different genres of BL, different viewpoints and worlds and how the, the BL universe, the, the, can just be adapted to all these different things so we're gonna dive in and just see see what this has in store for us Yeah, yeah, too, too fast, too fast, too fast, and I, I, I can't read that fast. <laughs> go, go back, Lord. Okay, five failures of death are natural accident, suicide, homicide, and undetermined. Okay. They're the cornerstone of any death investigation. Okay. Determination of manner of death relies a lot relies on a lot of information. Such as ah! Why, 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 how do you expect people to read this fast? Alright. <laughs> Such as crime scene and the body itself. Okay, Lord. Ah! What's what? People! The most important thing is to listen to what the body tells you. Okay, Jesus. I don't know how y'all expected anybody to read this. Y'all, y'all out of your damn minds. I need a couple. Who died? 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 I can't imagine having to see that kind of stuff on the daily. It takes a very special person with a very special mind to be able to deal with that on the regular. Even the theme music gives me very... Hello. 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 <laughs> Hello. Can I get my thoughts out, please, Lord? Yes. Stop showing me people. Even the music gives me very, like, mystery, discovery, espionage kind of vibes. Not really espionage, but, like, very mystery, investigative, Sherlock-ish kind of vibes. 
วิ่งผ่านบอกที่นี่ก็เป็นแค่อำเภอธรรมดาธรรมดาแห่งหนึ่งที่ไม่ค่อยมีอะไรพิเศษผมชื่อบรรกิจเป็นแพทย์นิติเวชที่เพิ่งย้ายเข้ามาประจำโรงพยาบาลที่นี่แต่ในความธรรมดาของมันนี่แหละครับที่ทำให้ผมตกหลุมรักตลอดสิบห้าปีที่ผมจากมันไปไม่เคยมีวันไหนเลยที่ผมจะไม่คิดถึง Is she given birth? Is she dying? Is she บ้านเวียงผาออกชุมชนแห่งรอยยิ้ม Is somebody g o n n help the poor lady? This kind of goes with the territory, but yeah. Casey, how are you? I feel like we should keep the masks on. The most d a n g e r o u s thing is the i n f e c t i o n that the c o r o n a v i r u s can spread through the body. The death is very rare from the child. The child must be taken away from the child. But what's more interesting is that there are many points of the body that are affected by the virus. แล้วก็ขาครับแต่อีกรอยหนึ่งที่น่าสงสัยอ่ะคือใบมาครับหลายจุดไหมครับอืมไม่มีอะไรอีกไม่มีอะไรแล้วนี่ครับเราเรียกว่าอะไรมีรอยเข็มอะไรช้ำที่ครอบแขนจะมันมากครับลักษณะแบบนี้นะส่วนมากจะเป็นพวกเซ็กซานดิสตรวจปัสสาวะหาสารเสพติดแล้วก็ส่งเลือดตรวจที่แหลมเกิดครับมาขอทานหน่อยครับหมอบันใช่ไหมครับครับผมชื่อพัดครับจากเพจข่าวเรื่องเล่าชาวเวียงผาหมอได้ยินว่าคุณมาเป็นหมอใหม่ที่นี่คุณหมอพอจะสะดวกให้ผมสัมภาษณ์สักห้านาทีไหมครับได้ครับเคสของน้องแนตตี้ที่ตายกลางตลาดผลชนะสูตรเป็นยังไงบ้างครับคุณหมอมันเป็นความลับนะครับผมก็บอกคุณไม่ได้ครับโทรบอกผมนิดเดียวเองยังไงคุณก็ต้องบอกตำรวจอยู่แล้วไม่ใช่เหรอแต่ว่าคุณไม่ใช่ตำรวจนี่ครับอเอาหน้าหมอผมมีค่าตอบแทนให้มันเกิดมันเป็นความลับนะครับผมก็บอกคุณไม่ได้ครับเข้าใจไหมครับ I thought you were here to interview me like that you're gonna write like a, a specialty piece about me the new doctor in town not that you're trying to get confidential information child เอาเจน pants are fitting right praise Jesus เจนไม่เจอกันนานกันสวยขึ้นเยอะเลยว่าแบบนี้ร้านเขาใหญ่มันเยอะมากนะเนี่ยแต่ก่อนยังร้านเล็กๆเลยโอ้โหกี่ปีแล้วว่าบ้านอะไรๆก็เปลี่ยนไปหมดนั่นแหละดีๆได้มากินที่นี่ก็ดีเหมือนกันอืมแล้วลูกนตตี้เป็นไงบ้างอะนตตี้ก็ชนะสูตรหมดแล้วแหละก็ยังไม่เจออะไรผิดปกติอ่ะเจนนี่แย่จังเลยเนาะรู้สิบตัวเองแท้ๆแต่เจนกลับช่วยอะไรไม่ได้เลยอ่ะโหเจนเนี่ยนะไม่เปลี่ยนไปเลยอ่ะยังไงก็แบบเขาเราไปชอบทุกอย่างเอาไว้ที่ตัวเองแบบนี้ไงทางทางที่บางทีอ่ะเจนไม่ได้ผิดอะไรเลยอืมพ่อบันครับเดี๋ยวมาคุยกับผมหน่อยเ
เมื่อวานในพัดเจ้าของเพจเลยนะมาคุยกับหมอใช่ไหมครับเนาะ it's just private ไอ้เนี่ยมันเขียนข่าวเกินจริงแต่ชาวบ้านก็ชื่อมันมากถูกไหมเขาหน้าเขาหลังอ่ะหมอต้องระวังเวลาจะคุยอะไรกับมันนะครับพอ Maybe you could have warned me about this when I got hired before I spoke to him. Oh, don't be. Hello. And we're in love. Hey, cup. Can you go check? Let's make more. I'm going to talk to you. เจ๋งนะครับคุณท่านี่คุณนี้น่าจะยาวใช่ไหมครับเอ้าหมอมาสั้นๆเนี่ยไม่ใช่พี่เอ็มอยู่แล้วครับเดี๋ยวผมพาคุณไปเปิดโลกบอกได้เลยนะว่าคืนนี้มันแน่นอนอะไรกันดีวะนะครับแข็งแบบนี้ต้องเจอนี่บาสจัดเวียงผาหมอกมาให้พี่ชุดดิไอ้บาสเกิร์ลอาการ์ดเวิร์กเอ้ยไม่วันหลังมาเร็วๆหน่อยดีวะโอสารวัตรกินกี่คนมามามามาหมอโหเลยสักพี่ต้องการงานทุกวันช่างนี่เราข่าวนะครับไปกำลังพูดมากสุดก่อนสารวัตรมาด้วยเหรอคะเข้านะ Girl I'm in the middle of taking a, a shot Can you can you not ไอ้ไข่ก็มาด้วยเหรอมาค่ะได้ได้ได้ได้แบบหนึ่งไอ้หมอเดี๋ยวผมไปหาเพื่อนแบบนึงนะเดี๋ยวอยู่นี่นะเดี๋ยวนี้ไปไหนนะเออนี่ละค่ะไม่มีการสั่งสั่ง Okay but if the sexy ass man bumps into me again I might have to go somewhere girl Girl, maybe you should, maybe you should stop shooting. I mean, she was looking a little blurry there for a second. Maybe you should not shoot the entire tray by yourself. But I'm, I'm glad you're having a good time. I guess. You do the whole fucking tray by yourself, Lord Jesus. And your friend left you there this whole damn time. Hello. Please don't throw up. Please don't throw up. Please don't throw up. Please don't throw up. Oh, okay. Well, damn. I guess we didn't have to wait very long for this first kiss. Guess it's drunken and non-consensual. Um, And now he's passed out. <laughs> Baby. Where the hell is your friend? You, you can't tell your friend to do better. Hello. Because it's one thing to go like, okay, I'm going to go talk to my friend. I'll be right back. But to leave you abandoned the entire night with an entire tray full of shots. Hello, oh, Jesus. Um, hmm. Um, squirrel. Yeah, your friend, hello. Your friend gotta do better. I'm not hungry, right, Mom? Don't forget to eat the joke that I prepared for you. Hello. What's up, Pete? เมื่อคืนหนักหรอหรือว่าจะไม่ฟื้นแล้วอ่ะโอ้ยสารวัตรเอ็มอะไรผมฟังพี่โดนค็อกเทลสูตรเวียงผามองมาอย่าเรียกว่าค็อกเทลเลยว่ะเรียกว่าเพียวเลยอ่ะเออวันสุดวันเอาใส่18ช็อตพี่ไปเจอสารวัตรตอนไหนเนี่ยนี่ใครอะไรวะเฮ้ย there goes the throw up 
Yeah, yeah. I don't need to see. I don't. I don't need to see it. What the hell would you record that? God. เฮ้ยโอ๊ยเอ่อสารวัตรเอ็มอ่ะโทรตามผมไปพี่ช่วยพี่ไงเอ้ยเอ้ยมาลงก่อนลบเพิกไวเฮาส์ไม่เอาท
รวมถึงให้ปื๊ดเพื่อนผมด้วยอืมสุดท้ายอืมเดี๋ยวจะต้องคุยกับเขาและหาชื่อเขาเองคุณส่วนโรงเรียนกดวิชาที่เจนทำงานอยู่อือฮึเอซีเซนโกมีบันค่ะเพื่อนเจนสวัสดีครับสวัสดีครับยินดีแค่จากนะครับอือฮึโอ้โหไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ไม่ใช่ I need them to be just friends, because I can't have him cheating on her. So we don't talk. I mean, I I I, I just got something. พอดีผมไม่ค่อยชอบตัวเองตอนเมาครับคุณหมอว่าเวลาคนเราเมาเนี่ยคนเราจะจำสิ่งที่ทำได้ไหมครับ No I remember vividly baby Remember the flavor your chapstick and everything ก็คงจำได้ลางๆเป็นช่วงมั้งครับก็แล้วแต่ว่าเมาแค่ไหนคุณถามทำไมล่ะครับพอดีผมอยากจะดื่มต่อสักหน่อยนะครับแต่ผมก็กลัวว่าถ้าผมเมาแล้วทำอะไรไม่ดีลงไปเนี่ยผมจะจำไม่ได้นะครับชาวที่ไปถึงสเต็ปคลอสต์ฉันชาวคุณพูดลุกอินเทนส์เลยแอบมีว่าคุณสเต็ปไปชาวที่ไปถึงกิ๊บผมอยู่นะครับคุณอยากจะเอาอะไรมาที่นี่มาแล้วคุณเคยมาขนาดนั้นเหรอครับไม่เคยหรอครับคุณนะเคยมาขนาดนั้นหรือเปล่าไม่เคยพอต่อให้ผมเมาผมก็จำได้ทุกอย่าง I remember everything จำได้ทุกอย่างนะครับ everything ดีจังเลยนะครับแล้วคุณล่ะครับจำได้ไหมจำได้สิครับผมจำได้ทุกอย่างเลยYour dreamboat just went ape shit on your old childhood friend. I mean, we were just having a beautiful little love connection here, and then you, 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 child. We need to continue this conversation, but at a later date, you, you got some things you got to deal with right now. But Lord, maybe you go, yeah, go talk to him, see what the hell happened. Scientifically 
ดทนอีกนิดนะแทนเดี๋ยวแทนก็จะได้รู้ความจริงแล้วเจน I want to know the truth now. What? 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 What secret underground shenanigans we got going on? สบายมากเจนไม่เป็นอะไรหรอกอันนี้บันคือเจนเจนมีความรับผิดชอบแบบที่เจนเคยบอกบันได้แล้วนะเจนหมายความว่าไงไม่มีอะไรหรอกเราพรุ่งนี้เจนว่างหรือเปล่าว่างดีเลยงั้นเราไปกินติ่มซัมเจ้าหน่อยที่เจนชอบกันดีไหมมันจะไม่เลี้ยงข้าวเจนเลยไอซี่โอเคงั้นพรุ่งนี้เจอกันเจอกันผู้ตายอายุสามสิบเอ็ดปีเป็นครูโรงเรียนมัธยมครับเช็คเลยบอกมอทิสยังไม่ฟิกแล้วก็ต่อไปเหมือนเดิมเช็คเลยก่อนมอทิสโ
ดเราหาเชิงลิเกเจอร์มาถ้าเป็นเคสแห่งจริงเราเชื่อจะต้องมีรอยเดียวลักษณะตามเชื่อที่ใช้นี่เป็นไนลอนมีคอนเทสชันแล้วก็เพติเกลเฮมอเรจโอ๊ตไม่ได้พี่มันมีรอยเข็มอ่ะสลอดครับครับหมอเคสีพฤติการที่ตายไม่น่าใช่การฆ่าตัวตายนะครับจากสถิติแล้ว 80% ของคดีฆาตกรรมมักเกิดจากคนใกล้ตัวโดยเฉพาะคนรัก Are they actually lovers? I I don't know. I don't know. Of course, that's where y'all gonna end the episode. Of course. No, the drama. This is a preview for next week. Or is this is an after. Okay. Don't forget me. โอ้พูดเบบี้พี่ลืมผมแบบลืมจริงๆเลยใช่ปะมันพี่เราพูดเบบี้เฮ้ยโอ้โหทำอย่างนี้แล้วกันเดี๋ยววันนี้มีงานเลี้ยงวันเกิดพอใช่ปะแล้วเดี๋ยวพอเองขึ้นไปได้บนเวทีอ่ะเดี๋ยวพี่จะไปยืนเป็นหน้ามาให้แล้วเอาพวกมาไหนไปคล้องเลยโอเคปะงั้นผมขอแบงค์เขาเท่านั้นให้หมดตัวเลยเว้ยดิวดิวเจอร่าม่าเจอร่าม่าลอร์ดอืมว่าแฟนว่าแฟนว่าเป็นวันที่ดีที่สุดทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุกอย่างทุก They're using all this like medical terminology throughout the series, and while some of it might be like very commonplace, like you know rigor mortis and this, that, and the other, um, some of the you know less commonplace ones, I just like how they're using those terms and they're like showing them and giving them like definitions on the screen for us, the audience, just to you know keep us in the know. It's kind of like slightly educational while still you know being entertaining. It's like okay, that's cool. I like that. I like that aspect of it. Um, But yeah, this the storyline. It I don't know. Like there's so many. It's a big puzzle. It's a big old puzzle. And like we just scratched the surface. We, this is just the first episode. We just scratched the surface. But there's so many pieces already that I can see are missing from this puzzle. So many pieces to assemble. And it's just like, man. Just when I thought, like I knew, or had an idea of what this storyline was gonna be, complete 180. And then once I went on that 180, and like, like okay, I think I know where the storyline's going. Another just like 90 degree. Like we keep just like, and I'm like, man, this is fascinating. So we started off with okay, new doctor coming to town. Cool. Coming back to town because he hasn't been here in forever, and at first I thought that first case that we were investigating, um, I forget the uh, Natty, I think the student, um, like I wasn't sure if that was going to be like a prolonged case throughout the series, or if it was if the series was just going to be like a series of different cases that were going to come about and you know piece together some storyline. Um, I wasn't sure. 
at first, but this natty person seemed to play like an integral part through the first like half of the episode um, and her case. And just through her case, we met so many characters. We met Jane, who was, you know, Doctor's old friend and school, te school teacher to Natty. We met the reporter guy who, you know, writes for the tabloids and makes up whatever he needs to do. Um, through Jane, we met Tan. Um, we also met, you know, the rest of the people in the office. Um, yeah, so we met a lot of our characters all surrounding Natty's case. And it seems as though it might be too early to jump to any conclusions, but like Natty, we know that she had the, the pinholes, which we saw, which were associating with some sort of drug. And I think they said they found met, met amphetamines in her system or something like that. Um, so yeah, she, she seemed to suffer some sort of sexual abuse as well as um, drugs, which I don't know if the drugs are before or after. I don't know. Um, but the school teacher doesn't see or didn't seem like the type to you know be t partaking in party drugs, especially after the converse the last conversation we saw her have with um, with um, sexy doctor man whose name is slipping my mind right now, um, Bun, Bun. Um, she didn't seem like she was ready to go on like a hardcore drug bender or something like that. So it seems like there's foul play and they're trying to mask it as a suicide. Maybe there was a suicide, I don't know. Cause like she felt, she seems to feel very, very remorseful and responsible for things. And even there on the phone call, she's like, yeah, that sense of responsibility, I'm feeling it again, that you were talking about, I'm, I'm starting to feel it again. Like, she feel, she's feeling this weight on her shoulders, and she's feeling responsible for Natty's situation, which, again, I don't know how much of that was just her, you know, putting imaginary weight on her shoulders, or did she actually have some part to play in the situation? What do we not know? What missing piece of the puzzle connects her to that situation as closely as she seems to be um but either way she's no longer in the picture um and just from the pinhole marks in her neck again it makes it seem like yes foul play is afoot and there's just so many questions so many options of what could be going on there's the whole um i forget his name but the guy that bun ran into in the market and he was like oh i thought you always wanted to go after jane why don't you go after jane and then there was a whole blow up at the birthday party between him and Jane, which again, I don't know what was going down there, but he was trying to talk to her in some sense um, and she wasn't here having it. And then Dan came around and just started beating his ass. And I'm like, I don't know what, what what's going on, but now, now she did. So I'm like, I don't, and I don't know what that guy does. Like Dan, we know like is an investor in the school or whatnot. Bun is a doctor, Jane was a teacher, this, that, we know what all these, and he's saying at the birthday party, you know, the director is such a, it's such a small town that all the important people are here at the director's birthday party. You've got judges, you've got this, that, and the other, and even my old friend here, and I'm like, what does he do? Why, why is he also included in this big party of important people, but you didn't give me a profession? Like, what does he do? I started getting sort of like shady gangster vibes a little bit from him the first time we met him in the alley when he's like, oh yeah, I got this watch. No, it's a limited edition. It's impossible. Well, I got to get going, Bob. Like, I was just getting some sort of like mm, vibes from him. Like, he might be doing some shady under, you know, shady underground stuff or, you know, just stuff that might not be 100% legal. And maybe it's a red herring. Maybe, maybe I'm not supposed to feel that at all. I don't know. But I was just getting those vibes from him. And then just his interaction with Jane at the party and like just the whole thing. Like it just, it's like, oh, this is sketchy. This is sketchy. I don't know about you yet. Like, I want to like you because you're cute. You're very, very attractive, but I don't know about you yet. And then Tan being this boyfriend or whatever to her, Jane, but then also flirty flirty with Bun, I'm like, okay, at first I thought we were going to make them our ship, which, you know, maybe they still are, I don't know, but then now there's this whole, well, Jane's dead, 
and you know we're kind of potentially angling it at okay well it could have been a lover's quarrel or you know they say you know the person closest to you 80 percent of the time are the people who do it so it's like okay maybe there's not a ship right now maybe like i i just don't know i don't know i don't know where the story is going but i i like it i i'm very very fascinated like it, it, it it's very fascinating and again just different it's genrically is that's not a word but the genre is just it just feels different from any of the other series that i've reacted to on this channel thus far and i'm like i like this i like this bit of you know mystery investigation discovery i'm not so huge on um it's not really body horror but you know, just seeing, you know, like body parts being cut open and this, that, and the other, you know, the dissection stuff. I'm, I'm not big on that. Um, but, yeah, it's fascinating. It's fascinating. I don't know what to expect. I don't know where things are going to go, but I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued. Yeah. So we're going to keep watching. Not right now, because it's like three o'clock in the morning. And I, 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 should, I should probably go to bed because I got work in the morning. Um, but yeah, I'm very, very excited right now. Like, I was, I almost did not record this reaction tonight. Like, I had it on my to-do list. I planned to start recording earlier today because I had the day off, but then I just got really busy with all of, like, the trans. You might have seen the post that I put on the community tab on my Facebook channel, or my U YouTube channel, um, talking about, you know, how things were getting blocked and you know how my alternate place that I was keeping stuff on Facebook was also getting blocked so I was migrating my videos so I spent the whole day just migrating videos from like my Facebook to my um, Vidyard account and just didn't get started recording until later but at this point like I had already recorded like five or six different other series reactions in a row so I was like okay maybe I'll just save this for another day and I was like yeah why not and now I'm just hype I'm hype I'm very excited by this. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. <laughs> if you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, turn on notifications so you'll be notified when all of my shenanigans get posted. If there's anything else you'd like me to react to, be sure to leave it down in the comments and I'll get to it as soon as I possibly can. If you'd like to support the channel in other ways, you're more than welcome to join us over on Patreon. You don't have to, but you're more than welcome to if you want to. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you. Before you guys go, a shout out to my amazing patrons. I can't begin to express how thankful I am for your support. And if you guys would like to join us over on Patreon, the link is down in the description. I love you guys.